Every business, regardless of industry, it should they should actually be thinking more or less like a media company mm -hmm. before they actually even go to their core business. So if it's a tracking company, it should be media first and then the tracking actually comes second. So when it actually comes to that, because um, from the way most organizations are still approaching their marketing, because in actually speaking with a lot of um, marketing managers or even, um, or even C-level executives in business, mm. they are actually looking at, uh, at social media as a kid's playground, mm -hmm. which is... Uh, which, which I'd like to believe that it's, 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 it's quite unfortunate, given, um, given the traction and given the reach um, of, 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 of where social media can actually take these companies. Mm -hmm. So what would you say, uh, especially right now, given, given what we have and how, how, how most companies are approaching their marketing, what would you say maybe to the business executives who are still convinced that social media is not for business? <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah, I, I think uh, to, to actually answer your, your question or to advise yeah. the business executives who are out there, mm -hmm. just look at uh, what is happening at um, the, 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 the 10 yeah. biggest companies or the richest companies in the in world. The world. Mm -hmm. What are they doing? Yeah. They're into technology. Yeah. They're on internet. Yeah, which is very true. And most of the companies, I think we've got our, your Facebook these mm -hmm. are the companies which are fast, the fastest growing companies. Mm -hmm. They are coming from the social media platforms. Mm -hmm. So that's where the real money is going to be. Even right now, you've noticed that even our money is no longer even physical. Yeah. They've created the Bitcoins. Mm -hmm. They've created uh, uh, these currencies, which are now yeah. being used virtually. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. what I'm saying to someone is if he's a business executive, if you are not on, on, on if you are never, if you are never going to join these social media platforms, mm. you are going to lose out. Yeah, they are going to regret after 10, 15 years. Mm. If you look at a guy like Grant Cardone, yeah. who has managed to actually build his real estate differently. Yeah, unlike what most of the Zimbabwean companies maybe they are doing, because they believe in doing their traditional way of doing things, mm. putting a lot of. Uh, I think you've got a certain company which has got uh, those small, small banners mm -hmm. by the roadside. Yeah. Each and yeah. every, especially yeah. in the low density suburbs. Exactly. That is the old way of doing things. Yeah. I no longer mm -hmm. look at that. I want mm -hmm. at my own time, I mm -hmm. Google, at my own time, I go on Facebook, at my yes. own time, I view my own properties on Instagram. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can even do it at 2 a.m. Mm -hmm. This is how it's, it's supposed to. Because your, your social media platforms, they can act as your agents. Mm -hmm. And the beauty about social media is anytime mm -hmm. someone can go through Jerry's timeline, mm -hmm. if they know that Jerry is into real estate, and check the properties which are actually available. Yeah. And I can even see the pictures, the videos, mm -hmm. without necessarily visiting, let's say, the properties in Chishawasha. Yes, that is sure. the beauty about social media. Yeah. I, I can no longer do my eight to five. Mm -hmm. Then the agent is no longer there, but your yeah. Facebook page can still be your agent. Mm -hmm. Your Instagram account can still be your agent. Mm -hmm. Your YouTube channel can still be your yeah, agent. Yeah. Is very your true. TikTok, you can even easily do a small video in that certain house which you are selling. Yeah. Yeah. I can yeah. go and check someone's account. So exactly. if you're a business executive, you're into real estate, like what I say, that's why Grant Cardone is beating many. Mm -hmm. I think he's got one of the fastest growing portfolio of real estate currently yeah. in America. Yeah. Yeah. It's no more than 2.2 .2 billion, but the last time I was checking, it was around 1.2 billion. Mm -hmm. So it means they actually grown with a, a billion dollars. Why? It's just using social media yeah. to get the capital. Because mm -hmm. I've heard him actually advertising that if you've got a 250,000 USD, which you're not using, please bring it to me. And yeah. it's the one who's going to handle everything. Yeah. Yeah. You want to venture into real estate, but you're afraid of the risk and you want to do, you don't want the administration. Yeah. You invest through him. Mm -hmm. And he's getting investors not only from America, mm -hmm. investors worldwide, from, all over, from yeah. China, from mm -hmm. India. Mm -hmm. So that is the beauty about social media. It's, yeah. This is no longer a joke. Mm -hmm. It's always about turning those comments, those likes mm -hmm. into what? Into, into money.
Wallington, Wallington.